have enough space on my computer. There you go. All right. Okay, welcome, welcome. Let's give ourselves a hand. So whether you, um, you could just give a, a hand raise as well in the emoji here. Thank you so much everyone for joining me today. Um, close the chat here. Thank you so much for joining me. Um, my name is Jalice and this is Infinite Modesty Design. And I want to say that this is one of our, um, our after, after sewing party event. <laughs> so the event has started since Tuesday, since Monday, sorry. And I know um, some of you guys have been um, sewing stuff, making stuff. Some of you guys are new. Some of you guys, you know, have been with me for quite a while. So I'm really, really thankful. Um, you know, sometimes when you, you know, follow people so much, you kind of get bored, but some of you keep on coming back. So I'm really excited. <laughs> um, I would give everyone the opportunity to uh, introduce themselves. I'm still seeing that um, Lotoya is just on on um, video, so that means I don't know if she's getting um I've having you know if she's hearing me yes or no, but we will start okay. So guys, I would say um if you are new here, so Nella, you was you was off okay, so I'm I'm re reconnecting you. So I was half asleep just before I I log on to Zoom, so I'm kind of song you know laggy. I apologize for that. But I want to I want to know um, just to kind of meet up with some of the new people or maybe people have been with me, but your names look different on on the Zoom. So if you could kindly um, introduce yourself. So I'm seeing here. So Latanya, are you still not hearing me? I guess not. So if you could re-log in, if you could log off and re-log in, Latanya, that would be good. And maybe we could, um, you know, we could get to connect. All right, so I see L iPhone. I know someone usually connect with the iPhone, but I don't know who's L iPhone. Do you wanna uh, unmute yourself and just let us know who you are? So L iPhone, kindly unmute yourself and tell us who you are. Is it she drop out or whoever the person is? Drop out. Okay, so you are here, Milatanya. Okay, good, very good. So log off and then you can re-log back in, excellent. All right, so I see here, I'm, I apologize with the name here. I'm seeing them, Rashid, Rashita? Rashita, yes. Rashita, there you go. <laughs> Thanks for correcting me, excellent. Thank yeah. you so much, Rashita, for joining me. Um, I'm just gonna give you an opportunity to introduce yourself, where you're joining us from, how did you hear about us? Assalamu alaikum, my name is Rashida. I'm joining y'all from Philly. I heard about your sewing class um, on Facebook. It came across my Facebook and I signed up for it and I was getting links. Unfortunately, I haven't been able to join the other two classes that was going on because I work 8.30 to 4.30. So when I seen it pop up on my uh, screen today, I was like, oh yeah, let me go ahead and jump in. I got time. <laughs> So I hum delay for all of that. Thank you for inviting me and having me. I just wish y'all all the best and everything y'all y'all do, and stay blessed and stay safe. Thank you, my dear. Really appreciate that. Thank you so much for joining me. Thanks all also for your kind words. All right, wonderful. Now, have you recently saw me on Facebook, or were you on my list for some time? Um, I think I will. I think I recently was on saw you. Okay. No, it wasn't recent because I remember your Facebook got hacked and you sent out a link. Oh, okay, saying, okay, okay. So you have been around for a while. Okay, no worries. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so good. it was before the hacking and everything. <laughs> got you, got you. Awesome. I just didn't tune in because when she sent out the link that said you was hacked, I was like, oh, okay. So I'm not just gonna go bother. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> Okay, good. Awesome. Awesome. So thanks for joining me. Now, did you take part in the event at all? You, did you ever take any part in the event? Maybe make a wallet, make a rose or sorry, make um, a, a mask. A face, I, I was about to say I made a face mask. I'm, I'm actually new to, it wasn't new to the sewing. It was like a rehancer because I had sewing actually when I was in high school, but then I was like, I'm paying all this money for my overgarments. I might as well just make them myself. So right. once I had got the pattern and everything down, I'm just like, okay, so I'm still learning. I'm not that great or anything like that. Mm -hmm. So <laughs> I guess with practice, practice make perfect. 
That's I'm not doing it to make it like a business. I'm not looking to make it as a business for me. I'm just mm-hmm. looking to sit there and save me some money. Awesome. Awesome. Very, very well. Thank you so much for sharing that. Yes. And as me and Nella was saying, you know, things, things get expensive these days, depends on what you're buying. So yeah, it's actually, it's a great skill to have. So thanks for sharing that. Awesome. So let's give her a hand. Thanks. Uh, let's give her a nice little hand. So whether it's a hand raise or a little nice little clap. Thank you for, for sharing that. Excellent. All right. So next I'm going to put on uh, is, I see we have um, Velvet Johnson. Velvetti Johnson. So Velvetti Johnson, if you are um, active, if you could kindly unmute. Hi, how are you? Not bad. Thanks for um, asking. And yourself? I'm well. I'm a little tired. I've been digging in my flower beds and this popped up on my on my news feed, on my email. So I was like, oh, it's that time. So I'm I'm usually not where I can actually jump on when there's a class or you know when things are going on in the moment I always have to like catch it at a later time when you know it's recorded or something right. like that okay but yeah I, I just happen to be able to jump on right this moment nice very nice all right good stuff well I'm happy that you jump on now have you take part in the event at all in any of our events I have not I have not. I've been really busy. I do alterations, so I've been really busy doing weddings for the oh, last okay. couple of months. So right. I've just been busy doing alterations, and I really just am looking forward to see what's going on. There you go. Awesome. All right, good stuff. So thanks for sharing and thanks for jumping on today. Really appreciate you on here today. All right, good stuff. Thank you. Okay, so now we have, I don't know who we have here um, that's, um, well, Shakira, you haven't been on for a while, so if you could just say hi, just kind of um, greet us a little. You are recorded now, so let's hear a little bit about you, where, you, um, where you're connecting with us from, that everyone know your face. I mean, know you well. She's one of my students for a long reading students, but sometimes I haven't seen her for a while, so can you um, unmute yourself? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, just, I'm very busy because I've taken my institution program, so that's why I've been away. Right. So yeah, but um, right now I'm doing the skincare part, and um, next week I'll be having my final exam. So hopefully, mm-hmm. I'll try about the sewing. There you go. All right. So like. I didn't know it was so much work. Right. Yeah, uh, doing all this. No worries here. All thanks for joining me, as mentioned earlier. Awesome. So let's give everyone now, let's give everyone a hand. Thanks for joining me today. Awesome, awesome, awesome. So I know April is at work. Teresa, thanks for joining me. Teresa have been with us for a while. Actually, Teresa have, have been with, with me from on, on my Zoom here. Actually, one of my longest rating students from in studio. Um then Shakira also in studio, Nella have been online, um, Claudia have been online, April recently online. So thank you so much for joining me. I don't think everyone have get the, the link because sometimes my, my um, email sequence doesn't go out. I don't know. But anyway, for the few that is here, welcome, welcome. All right. So for, for those who know, who know us, and then I think some of you guys have been on my email list for a while. So um, may familiar with my name. If you're in my group, you know my name is Jalise. And of course, we teach you the art of sewing online or to master the art of sewing and fashion online. That's who we are. Now, I'm just going to see if I can share my screen if I can't, if I cannot. I just wanted to find out from, for those who um, take the class, I want to, let me just get to the, the page of the class. Sorry, I'm going to, I'm going to stop the screen here. Um, I know who, I know Shakira said, no Shakira, um, Nella said she had joined the uh, the event, so she did something. Um, have anyone else, Claudia? Did you do anything? Um, uh, Teresa, did you do anything with the event? Um, just want to know if you guys had take part, yes or no. Even though you didn't, because I know you had did before previously, but I just want to know if you guys had take part in it again. Well, I'm. Um, I did my cutting tomorrow. Please go do my sewing because I I was baby. I had baby, um, babysitting for the couple of days. Right. Okay. And I don't have my machine with me, so tomorrow I'm home. So I'm hoping to do some stitching up tomorrow, please. Oh, okay. Okay. Sounds good. 
Sounds good. Awesome. All right. So let me hear who took part in the event and uh, let me see what you make. You're in the hot seat. So hmm. who took part in the event? <laughs> Nella, is it you? Okay, so I'm going to put you in the hot seat. I think you're um, So uh, Monday we had to make a mask. So this is my mask. Nice. It's, I just have to do some adjustments because it's a little bit big, especially for the air piece. So it's a nice fit. Yeah, nice. You could maybe adjust the elastic a, a bit probably, yeah. Yes, yeah. yeah. Awesome. My, son, my son wants this one, but I don't know. <laughs> Wait, if you, you don't have, okay, <laughs> if you have more fabric. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, I have more fabric so I can make it for him. And then yesterday we did the pillowcase, right? So. Okay, there you go. Um, nice. And you, you remember you said you're gonna buy a pillow. Have you bought a pillow this time to put in it? I, I can't find a pillow that was the, like the square pillows. Like I keep seeing the, um, the rectangle one. So maybe I have to go to like maybe a winners or home sense. Cause right. I was looking at the dollar store, but you know. Oh, I think, I, I, I think in Toronto, I mean, you could find one in, um, I don't know if you know, lens mills, lens mills, lens mills in office road. They, oh yes. Yeah. In the back, if you go to the back, if you just ask them, they'll let you know, but in the very back they have, they have selling, or even on office, road, I think maybe, you know, in those stores there, you should mm -hmm. be able to get, but lens mill, I know for sure you could actually get pillows, yeah. Okay, all right, I'll try there. Yeah. And this is my fabric wallet. <laughs> so I have a dress with that fabric, so yeah, that's look, look nice. Yeah, I love this fabric, but I'm like, oh, I'm, I'm breaking it off. Piece <laughs> let's give her a hand, guys. Come on, let's give her a hand. Oh my goodness, let's give her a hand. If it's a hand raise or a clap or a thumbs up when your emojis. <laughs> Very nice, very nice. I love that. You gotta show me that again. Come bring it back again. Second rounds again. I really love that fabric. Because you know what? I have an outfit with that. So I'm thinking, okay, good. Yes, yeah, yeah. <laughs> very nice. Okay, excellent. Very, very nice. All right. So what did you show us? The, the fabric, the um, oh yeah, the pillowcase cushion and the face mask. Fantastic. So yeah. three days stretch. Excellent. So let's give Nella one more round of applause. One more round of applause. Thank you, Nella, for, for sharing that. Fantastic. So I'm seeing you get some hand claps here. Excellent. Okay, so who else? Thank you, guys. <laughs> who else take part in the in the um event? Anyone else take part in the event that want to share? No one else. Or who else have any um any any uh, past event um project with you beside you that you could actually show? Because at the end of the day, whether it's this event or the previous event, you have the the the, the um the project. Who else have anything around? No. I know I know Teresa, you did. Teresa, are you active to talk right now? And Claudia, I know you did. Shakira, I never take part in the event, no? Okay, go ahead. I think I think Grace, Grace, did you want to say something? <laughs> oh, well, I'm just watching uh, what people are doing. Okay. Oh, yeah. okay, okay, no worries. I thought you did. I think I sent you the link. Did you happen to take part or not? I just saw it now. No, the link for the um did everyone get the link this morning for the class? Did well, every I just saw mine. You didn't get the link for the class this morning, M M Rose? I mean, Grace? No. Hmm, this email sequence, eh? I didn't uh, get a link neither. Hey, I'm telling you. I just got the link tonight for the class. Wow. I just and got it just now. For the Zoom call. Yeah, I just got mine just now. This is serious. Mm -hmm. I send the link out, and sometimes I have, because that's why I realize the people who actually take the, the class, join the first time, because I realized something is wrong with the email because I had that problem before. So if you say you just got it, then a lot of people did not get the link to, for the class today. I think it came at 6 a.m. this morning. Sorry, uh, uh, Shakira? Shakira? It came at 6 a.m. Yeah, so you got it, right? But a lot of people yes. on my list didn't got it, and that's amazing. Hmm. Everyone else here um, that is on um, on Zoom, are you on in my email um, list? So Rosemary, James, Philip, are you on my list? Because I know you was communicating with me on on um, on um, Facebook. Oh God, it this morning. 
Yeah, so, okay, because this, you say you only got it this morning, Teresa. Okay. So you did got it this morning. All right. Okay. Rosemary James Philip, I know you're just joining me. Did you got the um, link for the class? Because I know you was having some issue. No, I'm um, good afternoon. No, I didn't get the link for the class, only for this afternoon. Only for this afternoon. Interesting. Okay. All right. Thanks for sharing that with me. Okay. So anyone else have anything they, they want to share? So three, uh, okay. So I'm going to put Claudia on. So I see Claudia on here. I just want to, I just want to get you guys um, experience. If you had ever make anything and you want to just share, um, I apologize for, I don't know the link, but if you want, if you had made anything and you want to share, I'll put you in the heart. So Claudia, go ahead. Okay. This well, I haven't finished this zip yet because I put a white zip, but I don't think it's looking good. So I want to change it and put a orange one. So I just based it. I didn't really stitch it up yet. Nice. Okay. Thank so you. that's your, for your granddaughter, I think? Or that's yeah. your? My granddaughter. Nice. And then I'm making a little one for my neighbor daughter, but I, I have to hem it up. We don't hem up yet. Okay. Okay. Excellent. So that looks nice. Yeah, that looks nice. Yeah. Make a little gather skirt. Fantastic. Yeah. All right. Okay. So Teresa, you said you 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 got okay, but you could not do that because you're not really home early on. That's no no problem. But I knew you took part in the event. You have anything close by that you wanna um wanna share? But anyway, we are um recorded, so I know somebody don't like them camera. Anyway, let's give um uh, let's give Claudia a hand because Claudia have been actually one of my longest readings. Well, not my longer, but one of my online students who took several classes with me, and she have uh been sewing, sewing, sewing. Like I always say, sewing is a skills. It's not just she learn a skirt. She learn a skirt with me, and that skirt bring her into making lots and lots of skirts. So she has Nella, Shakira, a couple of you guys. Um, I have um people who actually is in my brand in in my mem. I have a few of you who's in my membership online class where we sew month to month. Um, also I have, and I just started the, the, the membership, what this was still in August, so it's not complete yet. And I have some of you guys who have, um, is in my, um, beginners class. So awesome, awesome, awesome there. All right. So what I'm going to do here, let me see if I could get, um, a shareable link here. I'm going to, I don't know what was going to, I don't even know what, what to say with the email to be honest with you. And just send me a photo. Okay. I'm going to. Julius, you have the face mask in the in the in the um group. I don't see it on the in the link in the arm thing. You don't see it on the um thing. Okay, we can. No, because I want I I cut the the face mask and I wanted to just double check again to show it, but I didn't see it in there. Okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna check and see. I'm gonna check and see what's going on. I'm not even clear. But I could check. You could stay, could stay right um, on when we finish your live today, and I could also check as well to see. Okay. All right. So, guys, what I want you guys to do for me, um, if I, I'm just gonna kind of reintroduce me, myself briefly, I wouldn't um, be long because I want to actually also do some engagement today with some question and answers. Um, of course, we are Infinite Modesty Design, so most of you guys see me on Facebook. You know, uh, may not probably the name is not there, but we are Infinite Modesty Design. Mm -hmm. Um, I, we do have some testimony on Google. One other thing I would love for everyone to do for me who didn't do, um, I think Claudia, Claudia, I'm not sure. Did you leave a review for me on, um, Google, but it, I'm not putting you guys on spot, but if you have done anything with infinite modesty design, it doesn't really matter what you have done once it's online. Kind, if you could kindly leave me a Google review, um, I'm just going to pull us up on Google here. I have a few Google review, but if you could give me a Google review, that would be wonderful. It actually does help, you know, people to kind of um, find me on Google, know that, you know, this is not just, you know, that there's a lot of scam online anyway. This is not just anybody just posting whatever. So this is me here on Google. This is the amount of reviews we have on Google. You could read it through. If possible, you could kindly um, give us a review on Google. That would be um, fantastic. I would be so appreciative. So I'm going to drop the... I'm just going to drop this in the chat here, guys, and I would be so grateful if anyone who took my class and have never left a, re left a review. So, Shakira, I, th I think I did respond to your, re your review because you did leave me one um, recently, so thank you for that. Um, okay. Oh, I'm not even sure what's going on, I'm Teresa. She's trying to unmute, but I don't even know. 
this Zoom is just, it's not easy anyway. So I'm gonna just send um, the name here. I don't know if I'm sending directly to you, so. So everyone, okay, so everyone in the meeting. So this is Infinite Modest Design. If you could kindly leave me a review, I would be so grateful, very, very grateful. All right, let me just share my screen again. So uh, is, is any, okay, let me ask this question. For those who didn't give me a review and took my class, I can I get a review from you? Yeah, sure, why not? Uh-huh, okay, so I hear Grace, thank you. Who else? Yes. Well, I didn't take your class, but I sure will give you a good review. No, if you didn't take my class, you don't have to give me a review because I want you to, I want people who take my class that actually would, you know, give me a review of what they make. But thank you oh, for okay. that. Yeah, so thank you for that, um, um, Rosetta. Uh -huh. oh, yeah, th thank you for, for that. Uh, <laughs> it's just that if, if you take, because I, I want to make sure that people who take, you know what, like, you know, you're in business or whatever the case right. may be, you want to make sure that it's a customer that leave the review. So that would yes, be great. Yeah, so th thank you for that anyway. For sure, I really appreciate that. But any one of you guys who take my event, whether you take my personal class, you take my one-on-one -on -one class, you take my group class, you take my free class, if it's free, don't say free online. Just say I take her class, right? And uh, thank you, Nella, for that. And thank you, Grace, for that. Excellent. So for anyone else who took my class and didn't leave me a review, you go to Google. I put it in the chat, um, Infinite Modesty Design. I think I have a review from Shakira. That's on here. Claudia, I'm not sure if I have a review from you. Did, I, did, I get you, did you get me a review, Claudia? I'm, I'm not sure if I saw a review from you. It's not, um, it's, um, there's no pressure, guys. I'm not saying, just because, because you are here, it's nice to say, yes, I'll give you a review. So that Yes, I did. I did send a review. You did send a review? Okay. Okay. Um, on Google or on Facebook? Which one? On Facebook, I think. Okay, I'll check. I'll check. Okay. So what I'm going to do, if once I see it, I could copy it and I could put it on, on, on Google, because with Google, the rating is even, it's go higher. But anyway, thank you for that. Okay, so for those who are not in my Facebook group, this is my Facebook group. Um, I'll drop it in the chat here. And I'm assuming everyone get the emails from me. So there's no one that actually just join on to my Facebook group right now. Once you get, most of you guys say you got the email this evening. I'm sorry for that. I really thought I said everything was sent out this morning. Um, but thank you for joining me. I'm going to drop it in the chat for those who um, is not in my Facebook group. And you can kind of join the Facebook group through this link here. All right. So I'm going to kind of try to move along quickly here. Because I want us to get to some question and answer today. We also do have a YouTube channel here, guys. And I am going to, I actually mentioned that I would play um, one of my student testimony. Um, from the YouTube channel. So I'm going to pull up the channel here and I'm going to drop the channel in the chat as well. Uh, if you're not in my YouTube channel, you could kindly subscribe. That would be nice. Kind of help me, you know, um, get, you know, so people, the, the more people subscribe, at this is better for, it's better for us. People get to know about me or know about our business in general. So I am just going to pull up, um, I think Claudia, Claudia, I'm going to try to get you um, your review here. And although everyone could watch it, but this is Claudia. This is Claudia. Oh my goodness, Claudia, where's where's the where's the review now? Where's the um the video now? I have so much video here, but I wanted to show Claudia a video, and the reason why I wanted to show Claudia a video is because um she's been making lots of skirt from the time she joined us, and she's still making skirt up to this day. So uh, I have it. Where do I have it? Oh my goodness. I have it. Oh, he's right here. Okay. Okay, guys. So I'm just going to play this. It's just one minute and, and 42 seconds. So. All right. There you go. Okay. I am wearing my skirt. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> I'm wearing it today. Nice. Wow. Woo. Nice. <laughs> and then I have this other one that I made. Uh huh. Very nice. And I have my. Bag, and I have my
um, in, in person. Yeah. It was, and you know, I really um, appreciate all that you have done. Had it not been for you, I would not have been able to do what I've done. And I'm so thankful. I um, I thank God for the, 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 the friends, like everybody else, you know, we connect together. We could call it, you not really call because we don't have each other number, but when we, you know, we Yes. Yes. And you know, such and such, and we all get help. You know, so I just thank God for the group. I thank God yes. for everyone, even though um I wouldn't be able to go to the other. Okay, so it is. It's, it's a, you know what I have. To, I had a lot. I have a lot of things going on right now, so it's pausing. So, so I just wanted to give so that. Uh, uh, Claudia is here, and I know she wouldn't mind me just putting no, that's okay, that's fine, that's fine. <laughs> so Claudia has been one of our students who took our, actually, and I remember Claudia very well. She reminded me of, like, Teresa. Um, it was, you was, like, you was curious, can I really do this online? I remember very well. You was like, can I make this cut online? She was in my beginner's class, I think, um, doing the yeah. bag. So some of my, so I, I have um, people who's actually just finished the bag in my beginner's class here. And when the script class come up, Claudia was like hesitant, but then she give it a try because I think you got encouragement from a few other students who had, who had did the, who actually had took the class and, yeah. and then she did it. And now, like she said, she make lots and she's making and making. So again, you didn't learn the skirt, you learn a skill. skill. There you go. You know, some people just call me and say, oh, it's a skirt. If, if you think it's a skirt, then probably you know, this is not for you. It's a skills you're learning every time you take a class with Jalice. So what do you take the free event? You, you did a purse, you did a, a face mask. It's a skills you're learning, guys. It's not just, well, just one thing. Because one face mask could lead with you making a face mask for your entire family. You could even, because I see a lot of people just make face masks even and, and um, you know, and sell because, you know, they, re, they, see, they see it as a side hustle that they could do as well. Or, you know, take my dress making class, my advanced class, which we'll talk about in a, in a little bit. And some of them uh, is, you know, is 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 making money as well um, in that area. Not everyone may want to do dressmaking for making money, but at the end of the day, whether you do it for personal use or you do it to make money itself, use the skills and it's you'll be saving a vast amount of money just by um, your skills itself. So thank you for, so thank you, Claudia, for sharing that again. And I want everyone to know that nothing is impossible online. That's for sure. That's for sure. Awesome. Okay, so uh, let me just go back because I was still kind of introducing us, uh, introducing who we are here and the classes we offer. Um, so who here uh, is is like I, I I know I have some a few people who's um, I think one lady said she's a, she's someone that does alteration. I actually, want to hear from you. Um, I, I can't remember who it was. Was it um, Rosetta? Was it you or Velvet? Johnson. It One, was me. It was you. Okay, good. So how let me just hear a little bit about you. How long have you been um sewing in general? Like how, how long have you been sewing? Um I learned how to sew when I was about I think about ten. I started sewing, you know, with lips and needle and thread by hand. Uh, my good. parents taught us to how to sew. Oh, and I've been doing it semi-professionally for possibly maybe the last four or five years. Nice, nice. Excellent. And, and um, I, you can actually Google me on um, I'm Eve's Boutique and Services. And I do alterations in the area of uh, Olive Branch, Mississippi. And Mississippi. Okay, so you could actually just drop it in the chat. Um, just drop your um, your uh, link or your name in the chat. That would be nice. So what what would you have to, um, what is your advice to give to people who actually is new to sewing? Or um, I have, like I have, I have an advanced student actually right now. She took my, she's actually started with me just a Zoom with needle and thread. This is how you start with needle and thread. And now she had took my advanced class. So what do you have to give, um, what advice do you have to give for people who's just starting into sewing, because I have beginners here and I have people who take my advance here online right now. What advice you have to give for people who want to start sewing or have, um, let's start with people who want to start sewing. What advice would you give to um, newbies? Like, let's put it like that. And then I'll ask you for advance in a bit. So kind of well, put you on the spot. It, it, I mean, just to be consistent, you know, it's a great art to know. Um, I'm just recently, over the last maybe five years, learning that a lot of people don't know how to sew. 
There you and go. It's like they are very afraid of it, and it's it's like becoming a lost art. That's so um, I actually quit my full time job after I got married in twenty eight, no twenty nineteen, and I haven't looked back. I mean, yeah, last year I kind of you know fell to wayside, you know, with coronavirus and stuff going on, but it's been popping since people are getting back out and starting to wear their clothes. Um, I just finished up two weddings, two wedding parties that I had to alter, do alterations for. Um, learning to sew, you, you can't beat it at all. I mean, for the beginners, it's just a lot of patience. And you have to measure, measure, measure. I cannot stress measure enough before you cut. Just, you know, if you have to measure 15 times, there you go. Just to make sure that you cut it properly. Right. <laughs> measure, measure, measure. Because once it's cut, it's cut. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you. <laughs> right. Awesome. Awesome. So nice. Very, very nice. And what do you want to say for advanced? So for, for beginners, definitely measurement is like is, is one of the gym that you have to, you know, one in one in my policy, in my agreement, I, in my agreement, it says measure twice, cut once. And that's something right. you have to either agree on Zoom for or, or sign. One of the two depends on where you take my class. So that is very, very key um, key for a, any levels, as a matter of fact, whether you're beginner or advanced for any level, for sure. So for those who actually had take my class now, and now they are so, and now they are competent. And, and the class I teach, the advanced class I teach, I teach people how to make dresses with their own pattern. So their own body measurement, how to measure themselves. So they're really... Um, really up there when it comes to the measurement and when it comes to, to making dresses. What concrete advice do you have to give to the people who know how to sew now? What what next? Like, what do you have to, what, what advice would you tell, would you say to them? Um, I don't know, because I'm still learning. I mean, the thing about sewing is you never know it all. That's you, it. You're always learning. It's just, it's just always it's just learning, learning, mm -hmm. learning. I mean, that's one of the reasons why I'm trying, you know, I'm watching your videos and whatnot, just to see what other techniques are out there. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Thank you so much for sharing that. And I really appreciate that. And I, I think the, the takeaway here, as she mentioned, if you mentioned what is beginner, she mentioned is the same thing. What is advanced? you never stop learning. And I always say to, 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 to anyone actually, who's because I do have a membership, we'll talk about it. It doesn't matter what level you are, never think that you are, I'm too advanced now. I can't, you know, I can't make a rose anymore. I can't make a purse anymore. Um, sewing is like once you stop for a while, you forget, you forget. Would you agree that um, um, Rosetta or anyone else who have been sewing? Once you, you, it's very it's, it's easy to forget if you stop doing it for a while. It's like anything in life. You stop doing it for a while because it's, it's a skills. Once you stop repeating, repeating the skills, um, eventually you forget. So thanks for sharing that for me. Sorry for putting you on spot, but <laughs> thanks for joining me today. And leave me your, your email because I actually want to do a talk show with people who know how to sew. And just a little, you know, kind of sewing talk to so just spice up the group and stuff like that. So it would be nice for me to connect with you or, or anyone else who actually want to join me on a talk show that you take my class and you want us to like, you know, 10 minutes, 15 minutes, size so would be a live talk show. Let me know as well. I'll be putting that out there as well. But thank you so much, um, uh, Rosetta. Would you be interested in that, by the way? Would anyone be interested to be on my talk show? Let's put it like that. Not just Rosetta. Anyone. Fantastic. Good, good. <laughs> so is it just Nella alone? I think, I think everyone, uh, Claudia, would you be interested in my talk show? It will be just me and you talking. Most likely I may do a, a Zoom share. So it'll be like, okay, good, thank you. So if you are interested, put a thumbs up, put an emoji, put something, and then I'll contact you because I want to I wanna start it. I, I had started before and then I stopped, so I want to start it back again. So fantastic, thank you. Okay, so let me move on briefly. So for those who always want to learn to make clothing, want to do alteration, want to sew for your kids, some of you I, I heard many times you have been sewing for your kids right now. Definitely that's who we are. We take away the frustration from you and give you the opportunity to um, learn to sew in record time. Like some, some of my students who take my advanced class, they started, some of them started in January, then I pitched the three months class, some of them signed up for the three months class. And it's amazing in three months what they do. Some, some, of, some of my students, their husband is, 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 is thanking 
you know, thanking us in general to know that his wife couldn't do anything today. I mean, this three months ago, but three months after she could make her own dress for church or for wherever. And now she's looking to make suit for her husband. So that, that's another thing we had to work on. So our goal is to hold your hand step by step and to get you to the destination from where you are to where you want to be. That is my end result. That's, that's my end goal itself. All right, now this is, I'm just gonna play this, just jump on this quickly. This is one um, designer that I, I like her clothes because that's the kind of clothes I like to wear anyway. But this is one designer here and this is one of her outfits. This is one of her outfits of 4,000, 1,300, 1,200. And she's in business because she have her skills and of course she could, you know, she could up level her skill, down level her skill, whatever the case may be. Sewing is not easy. Sewing is not like, you know, one, two, three. Many people have started my class drop out because they never thought, you know, it was like this. So again, you could, you could go very far with your skills itself. So this is just one design I really like, and this is her price of her clothing itself. Okay, let me, sorry, I didn't need to stop it here. Let me go back here. Um, all right. So some of the classes we offer, like we offer the free classes. Some of you guys um, are on my email list. We do offer a beginner's class. The beginner's class itself, it's where we teach you how to make a laptop bag. Some of you guys have taken this class. That class is kind of geared that like if you have no clue of the sewing machine, I want to take time to make sure you understand the foundation of the sewing machine. And this price is in Canadian dollars. If anyone would be interested in our, begin in our beginner's class, uh, you have never touched a sewing machine before. We do recommend one of the Singer Heavy Duty brand, and we teach you step by step itself online if you never sewn before. So that's one of the classes we offer. And other classes we offer again, and I want if everyone could stay on, I want us to do some some trivia question as well, like some um, question and answers, um, just to kind of you know get to know a little bit about the sewing machine and that to kind of have fun just before we go. Another class I offer is the online dress, is the online skirt making class. Most of you guys who take my beginners class had took my um, skirt class because it's like a next level to kind of give yourself that boost and that com and that competent um, in sewing. So we do have the skirt class. That's the next class we have online in studio. Like in studio class, it's a little bit different, but online we do have this online. So I'm just gonna pull up the, the, the ad here that I have. So our next class is supposed to be September the 3rd. Um, I think it's a, it's a Friday and it would be like a, either two or three, most likely the three days class where you learn to make your own skirt itself. Right now, if anyone, I know some of you guys have taken the class, I will send it out through email. If anyone wanna sign up for the class, I do have a discount code for the class where you get $50 off. It's, and also if you take the class and you're not in my membership, you get one month free of my membership itself. I'm gonna talk about my membership lower down itself um, as I go along. But for anyone who wanna take the beginner's skirt class, I do have a discount code. Of course, I'll run the class once I have sufficient registration itself. Because it's online, I'm, I'm not really strict with registration, but we'll see how much people that sign up itself for the class. And I will send it in your email. That's a discount code you could get um, because on my website, you have to pay um, taxes. So that will kind of help reduce the taxes and all that as well. So it's 250 Canadian for the class. Um, US is, I think is, is less, is one something US, but you will still get $50 Canadian off um, if you should register um, for the class. I will drop the code in the link. Sorry, I could drop the, um, the link in, um, in the chat. So I'm just gonna drop the link in the chat for anyone who's interested in taking our skirt making class. All right, so this is a is a is a in studio event I have. If COVID, you know, kind of give us leeway, I did call around some places today. There wasn't really taking anyone right now, so the my my in studio event is on a halt right now. One of the class I would give, I would have um a, a few people to, to get uh one month free of the online membership class. I'm gonna show you what it's all about. The online, the online membership class, we, we connect live every single month on Zoom. Now, one of my reasons for creating the online membership, guys, is, is to keep us connected. This is how we come on Zoom right now, is to kind of keep us close knitted the sewing community together. Because I have a lot of students who took my class, like I, I, Nella had met her for over um, like a year or something now, and she bought a machine. A lot of people met me online, they bought a machine, and the sad thing is, is to find is that after I met them after a couple of months, 
nobody really sold. So they invest in the machine. Some of the machine is $100, $200, $300. You invest in the machine. And then after when I met my students now, nobody sews. So this is one of the way to kind of keep people to uh, keep on sewing um, by opening this membership site where I, I not just post videos. I post videos, absolutely not. I post videos and I come on lo um, live once a month. Most likely I would do it twice a month because I like connecting with people as for those people who kind of know me now, they could realize I like connecting with people, um, especially my sewing community. But for the goal now is one time per month, I have it where we connect live on Zoom um, every single month. I upload, every, I upload new video monthly. We just started the membership this month. I have right now over 40 videos and then I should add some more videos for next month as well as we go along. We have monthly live Zoom meetup. We have exclusive um, you know, question and answer session with Jalice. I'm just gonna pull up these, the, um, let me pull it up here to kind of, show you around what we are talking about with the membership. Some of you guys are in the membership as, as well. Um, like some of you guys are on here with me are in the membership. So you have an idea what I'm talking about, but I'm just gonna pull up the membership to kind of show you around just a little tiny bit. For those who want a sewing community where we're not just you know in a group and we post things, everybody posts things, how nice it is, but you itself will come online every single month and you could keep sewing. And then I also have the opportunity where you could do, um, if you refer someone um, to us, we do have a referral program where you would get um, bonus as well. So we do have that as well. Let me see if I could share that um, briefly with you all. So I'm just gonna share that here. So this is, this is the membership itself here. We usually do our monthly Zoom, um, Meet up. Let me see here. So I, 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 we met up three times already. I haven't put the the um, I haven't put the video. I haven't posted the video here. So this is one of the yes. meetup we have um, on Zoom. Join. So um, this is some, some. This is one of the first meetup we had on Zoom. The second meetup we had on Zoom. This is the second meetup we had on Zoom. There's a third meetup we actually met last week. Um, my goal is to keep the community alive, keep us sewing, and we encourage each other to keep sewing. That's the actual goal of the membership. It's not a place where you just get a whole heap of um, videos and you on your own, no. It's a place where we sew, grow and strive together. If you're a beginner and you say, no, Julius, I don't wanna take a beginner's class, but I just wanna take my time and learn the sewing machine. We have that in the membership as well. You could take your time and learn the sewing machine. Um, I have lots of, um, like lots of videos to upload in there. We learn about fabric. Um, sewing patterns. I know a lot of people don't know about the sewing pattern. We have a section with the sewing patterns in there. And one of the good things with the, with the membership, sometimes I would come up, I would say, you know, let's do this project, guys, prepare that. I may not do it with you, but I would help you to prepare the project. So next time we meet everyone, do the project. But because you know you have that accountability that next time, you know what, we're going to connect on Zoom next month. I must at least do my, my whatever project we decide to do this month. That encourage you to sew, guys. So that's the goal of the membership is not where you in there and you as a ghost town. Absolutely not. So we have some videos to put in there, sewing techniques, um, sewing room accessory. There's a lot of things I have to put in there. Some of the things I haven't put in there yet, as yet. Some, um, uh, again, skirts, tops, that's simple skirts, simple tops. Um, bags and purses, there's a lot of bags and purses that have to go in there. Some of them is already in there. For instance, I have this bag. This is one of the bags we make. Claudia had post in the, in the review. Accessory, I have lots of accessory. Right now I have the rows. Our assignment for this month was to make a row. So some of our students actually um, cut out the rows. We have clothing alteration in there. I have to put in how to shorten, how to lengthen. And we know here, as, as we have a lady who do alteration, I wouldn't go heavy like wedding dress, <laughs> but I would do the basic where people cut a pants, uh, cut a skirt, it's too tight, it's too short. Those alteration there, because those things cost money. I recently do alteration for a lady. And if I, 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 I I'm, I'm not going to charge her because, you know, I know her or whatnot as a mutual business um, friend. But if I was to charge her one skirt I cut and then I, I made a slit, I would charge her maybe $50 just for that because it took me some time to take it out and iron it and redo it. Alteration is expensive. So we do have that in there to put videos in there, gifts, idea, home decor. We plan to do bedroom set. I haven't done it yet. Bedroom set, you know, pillow sham, cutting set, all those things are coming and, and so on and so forth. And then of course, more ideas coming in as well. So the, again, this is the first month it is, and that's our goal to keep posting video and come on Zoom every single month um, to connect with our 
so in membership students. So this is the, the fee, just for those who are interested might, might, might wonder what's the fee. Because we, we love sewing and we want people to keep sewing, maybe you have taken my advanced class, maybe you've taken my beginner's class, maybe you've taken any class, the price is unbe un unbeatable, I would say. We say $79.54 a year. So not a month, not three months, not six months, an entire year. If you go for the yearly package or $99 an entire year, because we want you to keep sewing. We just want to make sure that, you know what, you have a sewing machine, join the club, let's keep sewing each month. That's our actual goal. Now, for some good news, I would have our advanced membership as well. So I would also add the advanced membership that the price, of course, would be different, where if you want to make patterns and if you want to make clothing for yourself, eventually I would add that in there. Not now, but as I go along and people start trooping in and, you know, I start getting more um, advanced students, I would put that in there. Um, and then, of course, the price would be way higher because this time you're making your own clothing. But for now, this is a beginner intermediate um, membership where we connect one time a month. And I encourage anyone that interested in, you know, sewing with the community, this is one of the best um, offer we have to kind of connect and the price is unbeatable. All right, so, so far, so good, everyone. So the last class we offer, there's a lot of things we offer, guys. And the reason why, because I get people from so many different levels, so many different levels, so many different levels. Some people, they, they, they've been sewing for a while. They just want to connect every month on Zoom. The membership is a great place to start. Some people, again, have no clue where to start. Then the beginners is, would be the great, a great way to start. Some people move from beginner to intermediate. They want to make their own dresses. Then advanced level is, is where you want to go. For our advanced class, I'm just going to scroll through it quickly. It's a three-month pattern drafting dressmaking course. Um, the link we have here, just to show um, what our students have been making, I'm just going to show it briefly, guys. I know I've been doing it over and over, but that's um, just me kind of re-emphasizing what we do. So this is our students work here. They make, them, they make their pattern from their body measurement. We teach them step-by-step -step online. We make circle skirt. We make um, six-piece skirt. We make this is the, this is the um, the gather skirt I mentioned earlier. That if anyone want to sign up, you get fifty dollars off um, from the registration. It's a skirt with pockets. Um, we make uh, the blouse. We make the pattern. We make the sleeve. So then make it top top from ground zero to hero. This is one lady right now. She's doing um she's doing um she's doing it as a business. She met me online. She's from the state. She met me online and now she's doing it as a business. So she also is doing it as a business and so on and so forth. So this is Hillary, one of my very first students who started with needle and shred, needle and shred in with the skirt class. The skirt class would come out on, on, on Friday, the, the elastic waistband skirt, that's how Hillary started with me. And now she's making her own dresses. This is um, um, uh, Angie here again. She started with me in January of this year, didn't really know anything, and now she's making her own dresses. So my goal is that you learn a skills, you don't just learn, um, you know, a dress or pants or whatever. And you know, they have sent me many other dresses they make. I just didn't add it on there. That's after they take the class, they've been making their own dresses now. All right. So I would actually, um, for those who are interested in our three months dressmaking course, that would be an option as well. And lastly, let's say you just want to, you know, you, you have a project and you want to kind of, you know, you want someone to kind of help you with the project. We do have one-on-one, one-on-one um, one -on -one classes where we charge you one-on-one -on -one and then uh, I, I help you with your particular sewing needs. So we do have that as well. All right, so the offer we have for today, if anyone's joined any of our classes, you get, do get the option to get a one month free of our membership. The next class we have on board right now is, of course, we have our membership class and we do have the skirt making class, which will start in September. And we do have a discount for that. I would actually drop um, the link here or also in your email, I would send it for those who are interested in joining the classes. All right, so anyone have any questions for me, concern for me? No? All right, so let's go into some question and answers, guys. And I think I may hear, I might probably hear voices this time if I go into some question and answers. Um, let me just bring this here. I have some question here. So I have some question with the sewing machine.
I'm hearing a lot of silence. I don't know if anyone want to say something, anyone want to add to something, any, ask any question at all? Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> okay, no problem. All right, let me, um, let me move on here now because I want to hear voices, not just me. Oh, someone actually put the, is it a hand raise? Rose, uh, Roseanne, James, you wanted to say something or you wanted to ask a question, dear? Um, I wanted to um, ask a question concerning more about um, your advanced um, program. Um, does this um, be like recording once or, or, or you actually have this recording to, to play back and work while, while you're in the program is a one-time thing. So that is a great question, Rosemary. So thanks for asking that. So how we run our, um, our advance or any, any program at all online, when I advance um, skirt making event, um, as, as some of you guys is in my free event, we do have the recording. So we do record the class. So some of them I record the class live or some of the, some, some of the time I record the class, me personally here, but I teach the class for two hours on Zoom. For instance, the advanced class. So I would teach my students step by step and let it, so they would do it, do the work as I'm on Zoom with them, whether we play the video or they watch me live, doing a replay live of the, of the class, I do record the class. Um, so you get the opportunity to watch the replay after the class is done. After the class is over, does that make sense? Or was that what you was looking for? The answer what you was looking for? Yes, sure. Right, so in this case for replay, absolutely. You would be um, you would be able to get a replay of the class. Uh, let me just see if I could pull up one of our classes here that I have. I'm just gonna pull it up briefly and I could just show you um, how, I, how, I, how I teach the advanced class. Actually one of the dresses we make in the advanced class. Let me see if I could get it. And this is, not, this is just for everyone in general because you know, who may ask, have a question on that. The benefit of taking the online class is that you have me, you have me coaching you for two hours. And for, especially with the advanced classes, three months, I coach you every single week for two hours. And also you have the, um, the, uh, the videos as well. That's the beauty of the online class. Let me just pull up here. Okay, let me just share the screen right here. And I could just show how we do have the online class. So hopefully we'll get this. So this is, so I don't, I don't know if you're gonna show up. Hopefully it'll show up, let's see. Yeah, so this is how we have it here. So this is measurement for the blouse, drafting the blouse. Like this, we have, a, this is the live class here. The live class was about two hours, I think. Um, so some of them I do the, 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 yeah, everything is just taking slow with Zoom here. Okay, so this is me now teaching. This is me doing the, the work here. I drafting it out here. Or oh, I, um, this is me again, you know, showing them what to do, what. So there's a lot of, and trust me, you could easily get overwhelmed. Let's say I just put you in there and I said, okay, you know what? Just buy the advanced class. It's very easy to get overwhelmed and frustrated. But when you have someone step by step kind of guiding you the process, I think does every, everyone agree with that? If you have every, if you want to have someone guiding you to the process, it makes life easier. Yep. There you go. It makes life easier. So this is how we. Sorry, what am I trying to do here? So this is how we teach um, step by step by step, and then this is the live class again. I think this is a couple of hours, whatever. So. Once you pay for the class or whatever class you pay for, we teach you live. And of course, if we had to do the replay, you ask questions, you make mistakes and so on and so forth. At least we're there um, with you itself. Thanks for asking that question though. Really appreciate it. Any other question, guys? Okay, so if in the absence of question, I wanna just ask some questions and answers here. So we have, um, this is an older version of a machine. So what I wanna do here, guys, I'm just gonna ask one of the question here and then we'll try to figure out the answer. Um, you, you try to figure out the answer here. So the first question we're gonna have is what holds the bobbin when the thread is um, wound 
is wound from the spool to the bobbin itself. I don't know if that, that makes sense. But okay, what hold the bobbin? The bobbin, guys, when the thread is being wind or wound itself from the spool to the bobbin. Is that making sense? Anyone here? Uh, um, uh, the bobbin winder. Is that your final answer? So for who answered the question, is that your final answer? Yes, I think so. Okay, all right. So that was Rose. So Rose, yes. Okay, good. So anyone else have another answer or have uh, any other thing else to, to mention? So the question again is what hold the bobbin when the thread is wound from the spool to the bobbin? Or when it's been, um, when the bobbin has been filled up, what hold the bobbin? The spool pin. The spool pin. The what, sorry? Bobbin, the bobbin winder. The bobbin winder. So Rosemary, so that was Rosemary that I'm answer, right, Rose? So yes, the, the answer, of course, is the bobbin winder. There you go, awesome. All right, so turn as the machine goes. So by turning this um, towards yourself, so listen to the question. You raise the level and the needle um, to place it exactly where you want. So what, um, what is that thing that you had to turn towards you while you raise the needle to exactly where you want it to be? What is that thing you had to do? So just imagine you on the machine now. You imagine you on the machine. Does the question, is the question clear? So turn as the machine goes by turning it towards yourself. You turn this thing towards yourself and it rise, it uh, rise the lower, so, so it rise and lower the needle itself. So what is that thing? Okay, so Rosemary, raise your hand. What is that thing? Is it the balance wheel? Okay, so is that your final answer? Yes, yes. Anyone else have another answer or, uh, uh, or anyone else wanna give it a try? Is it the balance wheel? Who mentioned that, Claudia? Yeah. Anyone else wanna give it a try? Uh, Jalis, Jalis, hmm? can you repeat the question, please? Yeah, no worries. So it, so turn as the machine goes. So by turning it towards yourself, you rise the lower, um, you rise and lower the needle um, to place it exactly where you want it to go. So you're it's right. Is the balance wheel? Okay, awesome. So in this case, the answer is yes, the balance wheel. So uh, Rosemary, get the answer. Awesome. Thank you, Rosemary, for that. And thank you, everyone else. I just kind of recorded who got it first. So that, that's, that's, that's good. Awesome. All right. So next question we're going to have here now. Let me see what I have here. Okay. <clears throat> okay, so this thing now, it works the presser foot to move the fabric. So just imagine on your machine. This thing now works the presser foot to move the fabric. Okay, so yes, I like the hand raise. So Nella, you could, you could unmute yourself and let me know. Ah, uh, the foot pedal. The foot pedal, that's your final answer? Yes, works with the presser foot. Yes, that's my final answer. Okay, anyone else have another answer or the same answer or any other answer? So it works, it, so it worked the presser foot to move the fabric. Um, the three dogs. Final answer. Final answer, Rosemary. Um, three dogs. Yeah, is that the is that your final answer? Yes. Yes. Okay. All right. Um, anyone else wanna give it a try, or anyone else? Anyone else going once, going twice? 
going once, going twice, anyone else? Okay, so yeah, so Rosemary, again, you are right. So the answer is the feed dogs. So Nella, thank you very much for trying. Yes, and I, I understand the concept of the, the foot pedal itself. Yeah, the foot pedal, but the foot pedal, you press the gas to ensure that the machine goes. But the goal is that is the feed, um, the, the feed dog itself that moves the fabric. So it walks, it walks the press of foot to move the fabric. That was the key word there. So if the feed dog doesn't move the fabric, it ain't nothing gonna be sewing today. It doesn't matter how much you press the feed pedal. So thank you for answering that. Let's give, let's give a how, let's give all our answers uh, a clap, 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 clap. Very nice, very nice. If it's a hand raised self, that would be nice to so appreciate them. Okay, so next question. Excellent. So next question, we have another. Okay, good. So use the lift or rise, sorry, use to lift. So this is the question. It used to lift or rise the presser foot to insert or move the fabric. Did I answer that? Is that the question? No, okay. Okay, yeah. So used to lift. So listen, listen to the key, the key word here. It used to lift or rise the presser foot to insert or move the fabric. So let's look at the diagram here and just imagine you're sewing. And then once you got the answer, you could rise, you could just put your, uh, you put your hands up. So it used to lift, keyword, or rise, the presser foot, keyword, to insert or move the fabric. So Nella, your hand is raised. Go ahead, dear. Is it the presser foot lifter? Is that your final answer? Mm, I, yeah, I guess, because it says used to lift or raise the presser foot to insert or move fabric. Yeah, the presser foot lifter. So is your final answer? Okay, thanks for that. Uh, who else have um, another answer, same answer, or just want to give the, the question a try? So use to lift or rise the presser foot to insert or move the fabric. Anyone? Presser foot lifter, I think. Presser foot lifter, okay. So, all right. So in this case, so now let's give Nella a hand, guys. So yes, is the presser foot lifter. Absolutely. Of course, we all know when we're on the machine, you want to um, insert the fabric. You want to lift up the, because if the presser foot is down, if my foot is down, you ain't moving my foot. So that's pretty much yeah. what the presser foot is here. So in order to move my foot, you had to lift up that feet with the presser foot lifter. So excellent. Thank you, Nella, for that. Wonderful. Let's see if I have another question here. Um, okay. All right, so I press to control the speed. Hint, hint, what is my answer? So again, lift your hands up so I could, you know, point to you. Press to control the speed. And I think we have a few of us here, so I wanna hear voices. Hi. Hi. How are you oh, doing? Hi. Um, is that, uh, let me see. So Black Baby 1K? Yes, ma'am, it's me. Okay, thanks for joining me. Actually, we was in the question and answer section, but um, you joined me a bit late, but did you take part in the class? Did you take part in the event? Uh, yes, ma'am, I joined late uh, because I just got the email. I, I keep missing the, the um, email, so. Uh, okay, all right, no worries. I, I really want to get into this. You really want to get into this. Okay, good. No problem at all. Are you a beginner, intermediate? Have you sewn before? Yes, ma'am. I'm a beginner. I just bought a beginner sewing machine. So it's like really small, but it's not It's not really big. It's, it's, it's kind of like the first, I guess my first sewing machine. I'm trying to figure it out. Okay, no worries. After the call today, if you want to stay back just for like a five minutes, we could talk a little bit more if you don't mind. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Uh, all right. Awesome, thank you. She said, you cannot communicate. Sorry, dear, I don't even know why, why, why that happened. Okay, sorry, I have no clue what happened. Maybe if you um, reboot and you re -come and you come back, sorry, Teresa, maybe that may work, I'm not sure. She said she cannot, um, she cannot communicate, okay. All right, so we were in the mid, so thanks for sharing that, um, ma'am, for uh, we could actually connect right after no worries. But of course, you are more than welcome to take part. We are doing a question and answer section, uh, session, sorry. So next, the, the next question, the last question I asked is press to control the speed guide. So Teresa, if you could just type it, if you know the answer and you wanna type it in the chat, that's fine as well. 
So, I need answers, guys. This one is too easy. Press to control the speed. What is the answer? Press tick, to talk. Speed. Tick. Okay, Nila, let's go. The foot pedal. Is that your final answer? Oh, yeah. Yes, the yes it is. So hold on, um, for the person who just um, uh, just come on, we asked the same question, but you had to raise your hand. Or just, oh, okay. Yeah, <laughs> so we could kind of, um, uh, just, I'm, I want to track to make sure. So who's doing that? Please don't do that. Um, I don't know how to stop this, but please don't mark on the screen. Uh, oh, that's definitely me doing something. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, maybe right, yeah, so, okay. All right, no worries, no worries, dear. Okay, so anyone else have another answer? So, um, um, ma'am, you wanted to say something? Miss 1K, did you want to say something? No, ma'am, I'm listening, I'm sorry. <laughs> no worries, no worries. Okay, does anyone else have another answer? Everyone is silenced today, I don't know what's going on. Oh. Any, any other answer before I move on? Okay. So Nella, you got it right, girl. Of course, it's the foot pillow. There you go. Press to control your speed. Yay. So I always say, guys, sewing is like driving. If you have been sewing for a while, you kind of probably get the gist of it. Sewing is like driving. You're on the road. And if you drive, you drive and you sew, you kind of get the gist. Um, you're, on the, you're on that guide. You're on the road. Pretty much, you know, um, you have to make sure your eyes is on the road. It's the same thing as sewing. You want to make sure your eyes is on the guide. So there's your, your, your speed um, control there. So thank you for sharing that. Okay, so I'm gonna ask the question here. Guys, just try, okay? So the metal plate, we, met, we just kind of look, imagine that metal plate. So you imagine where the metal plate is on your machine has opening, hold on, let me just, has opening for the needle and the feed dog. So the metal plate has opening for the needle and the feed dog. Does anyone want to try? So this is the diagram here. You could just watch. Just imagine where the metal plate is. Okay, I want to make sure everyone is active. I don't know. I, I... So Rose, uh, Rosanna, are you still active? Claudia, um, Shakira? Latanya, Nella, April. Okay, no, I know April was at work, so I'm not going to disturb her too much. Okay, so just give it a try, guys. We're all here to learn. So I think someone had to lift up their hands if, if, if our privilege was previously. So the metal plate, just imagine where the metal plate is on your machine, has opened for the needle and the feed dog. What's the answer? Yes. Yeah, so you could answer. Uh, is it um, Roseanne? You could answer, or or Nella? I think I heard you. Yes, is Rosanna Is the answer is yes. No, no, no. The answer is not yes or no. The answer. I think you had to look at the the diagram here and tell me what's the answer. So the metal plate has opening for the needle and the feed dog. What is the what is that area called? Um, uh, I would say the bed extension. There you go, exactly, it's right in front of our face. Awesome, so yes, so the presser food, the bed extension, the feed dog and the throat plate. So that's would be the metal plates here. All right, good stuff. So there's a few more questions and then we'll wrap up today. So adjust and the length of the stitch. So imagine, so just, just look at the diagram here, guys. It, this thing adjusts the length of the stitch. So let's look at the diagram nicely and see what would be the answer. Adjust the length, that's the keyword of the stitch. So adjust the length of the stitch. Um, uh, this uh, the stitch. Hold on, let me see this. I'm going to say adjust the length. Oh 
I'm going to say this stitch. I'm going to say this stitch with regulator. The stitch with let regulator. That's your final answer. Because my machine is different. So. Yeah, I know. It's an old machine. I know. <laughs> Anyone else? What? So, so you say the stitch regulator, Nella? Hold on, let me, let me, let me think because I'm seeing it right here. I think it's the stitch length regulator. Like I don't want to. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just looking at my machine and it's like in the opposite direction. So, you know, I'm going to stick with the stitch length regulator. Okay. Final answer. Is that your final yeah. answer, Diary? Yes, okay. my final answer. <laughs> All right. So, um. Anyone else have another answer or want to um, agree with Nella on that, on the final answer? Anyone else? I don't know. I'm not hearing I said that. Answer. I said this thing. Oh. Okay. All right. So I, I, you, did you raise your hand? I did, probably didn't hear you raise your hand. I was hearing Nella. So, all right. Oh, this one. Oh. Yes. So Nella was right. Awesome. So the stitch length um, uh, regulator. Okay, so used to reverse the machine to go backwards. Bonus question. So it used to reverse the machine to go backwards. That's a bonus, guys. Let's go. Yep, Nella. Reverse lava. I don't know if it is. So is that Nella? No, I want everyone to raise your hand. No, we don't just shout the answer. So we had to make sure we raise our hands. Okay. <laughs> or you could actually just say, um, you know, uh, me, whatever. The, yeah, the reverse lever. Okay, so who <laughs> said that first? I hear someone say it first. Uh, I don't know who said it first, but somebody did say it before me. Yeah. Said it, Claudia. Okay, Claudia, you said it first. Okay, <laughs> but I don't know what to raise. I don't know what to raise the hand. That's why. Okay, okay. All right, no worries. So just say, just say, just say Claudia at least, yeah. All right, good. So, so yes, it is the, um, of course, well, we, we, we kind of know the, the, the value of backstitching is very important to do our backstitching. Yes. What your backstitching is like you're walking with a garment that is, that's eventually going to fray anyway. So there you go. A lot of my students who took my class and the backstitch could be an issue at first. Like, do I have to backstitch? Yes, you have to backstitch. Yeah. So, so there you go. Without your backstitch, you, you ain't doing anything. So awesome, awesome. All right, fantastic. Okay, so I will just ask probably one more question. Um, and then that's pretty much it. I think I asked this question in the so content seam allowance I'm marking for. Okay, this is the last question I'm gonna ask, and that's it. So look at your machine if you have, or imagine your machine if you if you you know you have one around. So contain seam allowance marking for accurate sewing. Where do you find that on your sewing machine? Do you find it on the bobbin case, on the feed dog, on the throat plate? Where do you find that? Contains seam allowance marking for accurate sewing. Where do you find it? Okay, Nella, go ahead. On the, uh, I think it's on the, the throat plate. On the throat plate. There you yeah. go. All right. Yeah. Excellent, excellent. Oh, so I'm seeing other hands is raising here. Okay, fantastic. Does the, does that help us as well to kind of refresh our memory back to kind of um you yeah. know kind of know our machine yeah awesome 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 all right good stuff okay guys so so Shakira I could see the work really have you going girl I didn't even hear your voice today but no worries oh that's okay <laughs> <laughs> no okay. and Teresa I'm so sorry uh, yeah no worries dearie I'm really happy to see you on today that's for sure because I'm like where is this girl. But anyway, um, Teresa, sorry about that. I'm not sure what happened. She couldn't um, unmute herself. Um, maybe next time. Yeah, she says she's trying to unmute herself and it's not working. So maybe next time you could uh, um, probably um, remove, probably log off and re-log back on or, you know, like turn your phone off and turn it back on somewhere that works. Yeah. Uh, so thank you for, 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 thank you. So let's give ourselves a hand for everyone. So it's mainly Nella, Claudia and Rosemary are here most of the time. All the same, I um, still thank everyone for joining me. Very, very happy to have you joining me. Now, if anyone here is interested in talking to me a little bit more about our classes in general or membership in general, I know a few of you on here are in my membership. Um, we will be connecting um, sometime next week. So did anyone start their rows yet? Nella, did you try the rows? Or, or, or can you get the-, the, the... No, I still, Yeah, I still can't get on. Like I can get onto the, the website, but I can't click on anything. But my computer is in uh, repair. 
I'll okay. try it on my um my tablet tonight and see if I yeah, can. Okay. Yeah. Because okay. I was trying on my phone. So oh. you know phone is different from the computer and the computer, tablet. Yeah. yeah. I'll okay. try the tablet. If not, then I'll have to wait until I get my computer back. Yeah, we, uh, but I think the, the email you sent me was a different email. Uh, well, the email you sign up on the website, is, is that your, your normal email you use? Or if you have another email, I could actually try it with another email as well and you could create a new password. I don't know. I'm, I'm just thinking. Okay, I can do it that way too. I can send you another email because uh, it's my full name, Nyla Felix at Ymail. That's okay. the one I use usually. Okay. All right, no, no worries. So hold on. If are, are you um you want to run off right after? Or you want to just hold on, hold on just after the live. I'm almost done anyway. I'm almost finished. Okay. Yeah, just hold on a bit. Okay, guys. I want to thank everyone for joining me today. I really appreciate um uh, Latanya. Even though I didn't, I didn't hear anything, um you, you wasn't able to connect. Teresa, thank you for so much for joining me. You guys are my regular members. Shakira, thanks for joining me. Rose and James, thanks for joining me. Rose, where are you connecting with me from again? I forgot. I think you connect, You told me before. Rose, where, where are you? Um, um, Trinidad. From Trinidad, yeah. So I, rem I remember Rose and connecting me from Trinidad. Excellent. So I think I have a few um, Trinidadian connecting with me, so which is very nice. April, <laughs> Nella, you're from Trinidad? Oh, I didn't know that. Awesome, awesome. Very nice. <laughs> All right, good stuff. So April, thanks for joining me. You are my regular, <laughs> sorry, excuse me. Uh, you are my regular, um, so regular member. So most of you guys are regular. So thank you so much for joining me today. Awesome. So if you, if Black, I think she dropped off. Okay, no worries. Uh, we're going to connect again on Friday. Um, this coming Friday, this is our last connection for the event itself. For those who are interested in the skirt, I think most of you guys take the skirt with me already, but I'm going to still share it to my, my link. If you know of anyone who want to take our classes, guys, if you know anyone that's interested in taking um, classes with me, I do have a referral program. The more you refer people is, let's say you, you, you refer one person is 10 bucks to take my beginner's class. You refer two people that take my beginner's class is 20 bucks. Three people is $30. So if you find anyone that want to take the class, just send them over to me. And then of course I'll compensate you according to what classes they do. I do have that referral program just to let you guys know. All right. So thank you again for joining me tonight. Have yourself a wonderful night. For those who is the membership, I'll see you guys next couple of weeks. Or those who are still taking part in the event, come on board this coming Friday. See you guys. Take care. Bye bye. Nella, just hold on. Bye bye, guys. And if anyone else wants to stay back to um, ask me any question, no worries. Other than that, we're gonna we're gonna wrap tonight. Good night, Teresa.